Hey guys, what's up? I'm back at you with another um, another review of sorts. Um, now this isn't um, now this isn't movie review, but this isn't of a DVD or anything of America. It's actually something from Japan. Um, I watched the entire thing yesterday on YouTube. It's really excited to watch it for the first time and probably the only time, but it was enjoyable. Um, what am I talking about? I'm talking about none other than the Common Rider, Common Rider. Decay Double Movie War 2010. Um, Decay Double Movie War 2010 is pretty much the first double movie. Um, he did make an appearance at the end of the final, um, at the final movie for the previous series, which I think was Decayed. He made a small cameo where they mentioned it a double for the first time at Memory Tower. But that's beside the point. Um, let me just give you a little bit of a quick rundown of how it works out. Um, the first six parts of the film, when you're watching it on YouTube, pretty much have to do just with Decade's part of the story, where Suzaska, I think I pronounced that right, has pretty much become a rider destroyer, which any rider that comes across his path, he was going to destroy. And he'll do anything to have him dead. So he starts killing them all left and right. Common Rider J, Sky Knight, or Sky Rider, even Blade, and um, Ryuki. And he even uses the Final Form Rider Blade to kill Ryuki. And then this kills him. But then um, someone actually succeeds in killing him, uh, which I believe is the Super Shock, Shock Trooper Clan, which is um, a new army that Decayed is going to fight near the end of the film. And they're just giving birth to their new offspring, which is a deadly warrior that will soon give force. So, um, Decay can't find him alone, so he requires the help of the other ten riders that he works with. That includes Kuga, Agito, Ryuki, Fize, Blade, Hibiki, Kabuto, Den, O, Kiva, and D End. Um, 50 points, you guys know what if you know what I mean when I said them in that specific order. But um, they all team up and um, Decay uses his K-Touch to evolve them into their ultimate forms and then they're um, into their forms on the K-Touch and then he um, he then becomes the final common rider for Decay. And then they all go on the attack, they defeat the uh, Super Shock army but the, uh, the offspring was disappeared. Into Double's part of the story, which is takes place in part seven. Um, now this part was called Double Begins Night. I don't remember what the decayed part was. Um, what the decayed part was called, but I do remember that it was like that. Um, basically, what starts off is that um, as I as I finally learned from a couple of people here on YouTube, Chotaro is one year younger than here than how he appears in the rest of the television series. Uh, there really is a lot of flashbacks, you know, to when, um, Narumi Sokichi, um, I think I pronounced that right, was, uh, alive. Basically, he was, um, Philip and Shotaro's father and chief. And whenever he would see Shotaro wearing a hat, he said, you're not boiled enough. You're not ready. You're half-baked. So, um, and we learn at one point that he is actually a rider of his own. We learn he is none other than Common Rider's skull. Who is a brand new rider that we've never even seen before. And he's also a solo rider along with Axel. So Axel and Skull are the only two loner riders in double so far that I've seen. Um, basically what happens is um, they have a couple of battles and they go to a couple of people. And they learn that this local priest that they go to that's kind of helped with, um, basically what happens is, um, they get this, um, Chotaro and Philip, while they're having their Christmas party, get this call from a famous celebrity to help them out with something, where her sister has recently disappeared, and she's become a ghost. Then later on in the film, they learn that the priest that did the funeral and prepared the grave is actually a dopant. He's the, um, dummy dope. Some people thought he was death, the death dopant. 
he's actually dummy because he did turn into into skull and then later um when um decayed and double will take out the two uh, big vet motor ship vessels they he um turn the baby combined with uh dummy to form an ultimate form like basically what the baby would look like if it was in its fully grown state and they do something kind of interesting they cut off decayed as he's they, they cut off double as he's um driving on his hard boiler toward the battle site and individually like it'll show their enemies asking them who are you and then like one by one it'll say like just a two and one and then just a passing through and it'll like there's a little, there's a little line between them and then it'll break apart and they'll both scream common rider and then they'll both attack um, they'll introduce themselves and then they'll go to battle um they'll attack a lot of the super shock troopers defeat them first and then they'll take out the um the dummy dopon combined with the uh, offspring which is basically kind of where we get an ultimate thing where Decay is always known for using Final Form Rides to help his partner kind of defeat the enemy rider, but this one wasn't really, um... Now, if you know what happened to Decay, the Final Form Ride attacks are basically where he would um, play a card, and then he would put his hands on their back, and then they would transform into a weapon. What happens with Double is that he pulls him apart into two individual pieces. So they get, become Cyclone, Cyclone, and Joker, Joker. So they activate final attack ride for Decade, and then they all attack, and then they're all put together again. And then Skull and Do Double have one final confrontation, where he says, "You are fully, you are fully baked. You look good in the hat." Now this movie also has tons of um, flashbacks, uh, most of which appeared in the double portion of the movie, um, like um, the time when we we see um, Shokichi Narumi for the first time. Um, something that happened was, um, we see Sotaro, um, and this kind of creeped me out. He was in a, he was in shorts, and he took his father's white fedora, which kind of reminds me of the one worn by Michael Jackson. He put it on, as he, and he pretended to do some criminal moves as he was whistling Jingle Bells, because this did take place at the holidays. Um, then the flashback was when, um, Sokichi Narumi did meet, um, Philip for the first time in that little library in that mind of his library. He didn't have a name, so he named him Philip. And then after he died and gave his fedora to Shodoro, um, the two just before that they could attack, decided make Philip and Shodoro, are you willing to ride with the devil? So he teamed up and they formed Devil once again. Although with Philip although with Shodoro in the commanding lead, he couldn't really help. So what happened was they unhenshined from Devil's form, and then they rehenshined into Fang Joker, which was his first official appearance. And unless the he, the episode of Double with his appearance air first. But yeah, um, we are introduced to two movie exclusive riders. We are introduced to Kivala, who is a female version of Kiva. And the bat is a little bit smaller, and instead of biting the hand, um, it's a kiss to the forehead. And another rider we are introduced to as a movie-only rider is Skull, or Common Rider Skull. Um, kind of looks like Rorschach when you look at him. Um, he did appear quite a couple times. And um, we also get these, get these Super Shock, the Super Shocker clan for the first time. I think they're new, but they are, I think, like movie-exclusive characters. And, um, you know, yeah, um, I say it was really enjoyable. Um, if they ever, you know, bring it over here, if they ever make it on DVD, ever, on sale on eBay, I would definitely pick up a copy. But, um, for now, um, you're just stuck watching, um, Decay Double Movie War 2010 on YouTube. Um, just search Decay Double Movie War 2010. You'll find it at, you might want to search with, in big capital letter, SUB for sub. But yeah, it's a very enjoyable film. I loved it to pieces. I guess that's really about it. Later, guys. I'm out of here.